I think uh, much of what has been said um, boils down to the division we often take in um, instrumental planning or operational planning and strategic planning. Um, and we often treat that as two opposites. And I think they are two flip sides of the same coin. And um, that we should um, yeah, not divide it in either or, but do both. Um, in the same institutions, um, it's not that the practice is doing instrumental planning um, and that uh, the strategic boards are doing strategic planning. If we do not combine, we, we won't... Um, uh, tackle the challenges we, we are um, confronted with um, because, well, instrumental planning is well, changing physical reality, is taking action, uh, is, um, well, has to, to, to work efficiently, but then it's about uh, changing the mindset of people. And it's about not doing things better, but doing better things. And as long as we only try to do that in pilots and not take that lessons to the, the daily routines, uh, they, as, as Hank Oving said, they will uh, stay pilots and um, won't become routines. And we really need new practices, new routines. Um, uh, like Alan van Buren said, if you de don't um, change the incentives, um, well, then you will get what you always got. Um, and that's the same with all kinds of investments. We, are, we have so much lock-ins. Uh, so we really have to, to rethink um, and to, to reinvent uh, all kinds of practices. And that is a hell of a job because they are practices we have been working on for uh, a century. Um, and then I come to a kind of urgency paradox that I see. That is, um, the less time you have available, um, the, the more important it is to slow down and to really invest in rethinking all these practices together. 